There's actually another reason why I call you guys blind little moles. It's because they're adorable and I want to protect them. But there is actually a backstory to that. Let me get vulnerable with you for a second. Listen, when I was young, I used to hang out at my grandma's house a lot. She has a garden. And one day I was just chilling, playing, minding my own business. And I see my grandma coming out of the garden looking for a hoe. I'm prompted. She says to me, she's like, I saw a mole. So I'm going to try and kill it. That traumatized me, see? Because I used to, I wanted to be a veterinarian when I was young. And she knew that shit. At that moment, my life mission was to protect that mole. There was no way though to reason with my grandma. Because you don't know, grandmas in my country, they're different. They, they, they're not sweet little old women. No, no, no. If someone threatens the yield of the crop, that might as well be the fucking devil. They don't care. They don't care about wildlife. Bro, she would have called me stupid to my face. I had to act covertly. I went with her, acting not interested. I was like, yeah, I'm going to help you. I was like five or some shit. I'm going to help you look for it. I'm going to help you. I'm going to help you out, grandma. My plan was to go see the, see the mall first and scare it away. And then be like, ah, oh, I guess it escaped. What can you do? Evie happening. Or, or, better yet, distract my grandma, distract her, act as a decoy. But the mole never came back. It was a smart little mole. But ever since then, I have this irrational fear that whenever I go to my grandma's, she's gonna fucking kill a mole in front of me. I would be traumatized. I've already been traumatized by this, by this whole experience. I even dreamt about it recently, bruv. My grandma kind of crazy, huh?